Brianna, good morning and welcome back to my channel. I'm fixing to head out and run some errands, but before I do, I wanted to show you my outfit of the day because I'm feeling super cute. So of course, Houston has had its first cold front, um, so I've got the boots on. Honestly, I don't remember where I got the boots. If I remember, I will update the vlog. But these pants, okay, so y'all haven't seen these yet, but these pants came from the Charlotte Ruse haul that's gonna post on Friday for Fashion Friday. And these are the most amazing pants, guys. I have literally worn these like every single day since I got them. They are super comfortable. Um, they look, they're called But I Love You is the like name of them. And yes, they do amazing things for my butt. This like mirror situation, it makes it very difficult to get a good picture. Um, and then the top is from Torrid, uh, but I got it like last year. Um, but yeah, I just thought it looked super cute and I wanted to show y'all. And I wish I could see my head, but <sighs> work with what you got, right? I have to stand like this far away if I want to be able to see my head and everything in the thing. Anyways, okay. Yes, I look cute. And I know it. Guys, I've been feeling myself lately. The things that need to get done today are I'm going to Tuesday morning because I saw an ad that they have their like side tables and stuff on closeout. And we've been looking for an entryway table for our front door area our front entryway so I'm gonna go look at that and then also I have an eye exam at America's Best at 1250. We have that Halloween party coming up and I want to wear a mask and I can't wear a mask if I'm wearing glasses so and it's, I mean I just need I need a new prescription anyways and so it just finally motivated me to get that done. I was gonna be going to Clear Lake to go see Rosella and Domily and my dad um, because I was gonna bring them a camera a camera a phone from one of my old friends but whenever he got it's my actual it was my fourth grade boyfriend which is so funny um, he he's a police officer in Alvin he lives in Pearland and we've stayed in contact through like social media but unfortunately whenever he got home to like get the phone and like clear everything off of it like factory reset it um, he realized that it wasn't working anymore. So I'm not going to be doing that, which reminds me I need to text Domily and let her know that I'm not coming. So because of that, I was going to vlog today and that didn't work out. So um, now it's just going to be uh, just going to be an errands running type of day. And I'm too cute to not get out of the house. Like this outfit, I just look too good. I just, I got to get out. And I don't know if you've noticed, my hair's a little different today. I am trying a new mousse. So, it smells amazing. It's suave. It smells really good. I don't usually actually do anything to my hair, but it's been frizzy lately, and I, like, like up here, have a, I've had lots of flyaways up here, and I don't like it. And so I bought some mousse when I was at Walmart last week, and I was like, okay, I really need to start, like, doing my hair, because I can't stand the way that it looks whenever I see it, like, on the vlogs and stuff. Um... Okay, I think I've rambled enough. That one's really pretty, but it's $250. Not what I'm gonna be paying right now. I think these were the ones that were marked down. <sighs> it's not big enough for this base, I don't think. Bummer.
a baby robe. I think Rosella might need one. Here's all of their like notebooks and journals and stuff like that. And some pretty pens, like decorative pens. There's more of their crafting stuff. They have a really big cutting mat. All kinds of cutters. They have scraps. If you ever want to make swaps for planner meetups right there. All kinds of things. Something for the mink. Brush pens. Got vinyl. It's hollow. Glitter. That's cool. I've always wanted one of these. It's one of the curved rods. That's cool. Don't need it now. We have a sliding shower. But cool beans. to get a better view of my outfit. Alright, just showed up to America's Best. I got an appointment in like 15 minutes. I do kind of hate eye exams though. Because I really hate the one or two, one or two, one or two, one or two, one or two. But I haven't had an eye exam since I lost weight. And one of the things that I hated was the machine with my big boobs. Like, it, I, it was just like a positioning problem. Um, so I'm interested to see if it's any better. Um, because my boobs are definitely smaller. Okay, I'm supposed to be there 10 minutes before. I got about three minutes, but I'm gonna go ahead and just go in. And there's a GNC right next door, so I might swing in there after the appointment and see if they have any keto stuff. Try not to spend any money right now. We're going into what we call our poor week, but I might just pop in and take a look-see. Well, so much for an eye exam. Um, apparently, the doctor has some sort of emergency or something. Um, the person that does the actual exams. And so after I got checked in um, and was like browsing the eye, and was browsing the glasses, they were like, 
ma'am, I'm sorry, we're gonna have to reschedule. So I guess I'll be getting my exam a different day. Um, so I just came home, I don't really have anything else to do. And I decided that going into GNC would probably be dangerous because I'm sure I would end up spending money. So I just skipped that. But I did want to talk to y'all about that spaghetti that I made. So if you watched yesterday's Tasty Tuesday, you saw that I made um, spaghetti using this Bella Bandaza organic soybean. Um, yesterday was the spaghetti noodles. I was gonna let y'all know if there was any digestive issues for me or Jonathan. And actually, the only thing that we experienced was kind of like a bloated feeling. Um, I didn't eat very much of it. I probably had less than one serving, honestly. I probably, one serving is two ounces. I probably had about an ounce. Um, Jonathan probably had about three, because he likes, he likes his pasta. So, um, no, nothing crazy though. Like, nothing terrible happened. Just, um, just a little bit of bloating, I think, so. But that's all. Okay, I'm gonna go get changed out of my cute clothes and um yeah if anything else hopefully i find something else to talk about or this vlog is gonna be like five minutes long 441 i think i'm fixing to make me a little snack i got a tablespoon of butter and i'm gonna cut off some slices of this queso fresco and just fry it up i just got that skillet out of our dishwasher it smells kind of funky in there and that's a clean load. I'm wondering if we need to like clean our dishwasher. I've never had to do that before, but I don't really know anything about that. Like, if you know, leave a comment. All right, let's melt up some butter. Here's the finished product. Be careful whenever you're pouring it on your plate. Make sure you're using one that's not gonna melt. Like if you're using styrofoam, um, the, the butter that you're fried in is gonna be pretty hot, so it might melt the bottom. And then I just got some smoked house almonds. Here, I'm up. There you go. These are the almonds that I'm eating and my unsweet tea. Got my pizza heating up in the air fryer. <sighs> Comes out really, really good like that. Poor Milo. He's stressed out right now because this guy over here is watching sports on the TV. And Milo cannot handle it because Jonathan's very vocal. And it scares Milo to death. He's okay, buddy. It's not you. He's not yelling at you. The game's not over. We still have the bottom of the eighth. Top of the ninth, so the Red Sox can score more runs because our pitching can't get their fucking jobs done. I'm gonna have fun editing that. Yeah, have fun. If you're new to my channel and you don't know, this is how he gets. This is normal, but Milo does not appreciate it at all. But anyways, nothing else is going to be happening tonight, so I'm going to go ahead and wrap up the vlog. Please pray that somehow the Astros turn it around and we get a win. Or Jonathan might have a heart attack from screaming or an aneurysm or something. Subscribe if you haven't already. Don't forget to click that thumbs up button and I will see you guys next time. Bye. To say I'm a little nervous is an understatement.